Hi guys, my name is Chitty Shorty, and today um, my teacher, Chitty Yeth, our camera lady, um, she's going to be teaching me how to make Play-Doh. So this is my first time making Play-Doh, and I'm excited to make it with you guys. So, Play-Doh. Right. Okay, so the first thing you do is put, uh, put two cups of baking flour. So that one is half a cup. So you can put four scoops. Four scoops of this big one? Uh-huh, of okay. baking flour. Does that have to be like a stack amount? Um, it's good to be close. Uh -huh. okay. Two. So it's good to listen to your directions. Sometimes. Two. Uh, okay, three. that's the third one. Okay. Yeah, Feels really nice. This is uh -huh. a good um, sesame activity, huh? Four. Okay, now we're going to put um, the red measuring. Um, you put two one fourth cups of salt. Salt right here? Uh -huh. Yes. Morton salt. Two cups, uh, two cups of one-fourth? Uh-huh. What does that equal, Chichi? Yeah. A half. Half of what? A cup. Half no. a cup? <laughs> um, I think so. <laughs> so one scoop of uh -huh. one-fourth cup. Uh-huh. Another scoop of one-fourth cup of salt. Uh-huh. Okay, okay and then now we're gonna put two tablespoons of vegetable oil. Two tablespoons uh -huh. of vegetable oil. Yeah. Crisco. Mm, you can be a little generous with that. You can put three okay. if you like, because it make it a little bit more um, moldable and pliable. Okay, so I'm gonna yeah. do three. Uh huh. And then you can put your food color. So my favorite color, one of my favorite colors, is blue. So I choose blue. Mm -hmm. So how many drops you drink, um, would you recommend? Like six, but I'm pretty generous, so I do like I just kind of drizzle it. Drizzle. Uh huh. Okay. A little bit more is fine. Can we like mix uh -huh. colors up, teacher? Yep. If you put red and blue, it makes purple. You want to put red? Red and mm -hmm. blue. Okay. Mm -hmm. I like purple. Yeah, that's what Barney says. Red and blue makes purple. Yay. All right. So this is a, I think a fun activity for the older kids. Um, even with the younger kids, too, you just have to like monitor them, and make mm -hmm. sure they don't put food in their mouth or use recipe. Mm -hmm. And then we already preheated the water okay. for two minutes in the microwave. It's about three cups of water. So we can add like half of that water, but add it slowly as you're mixing the um, the uh, the mixture, the ingredients in the bowl. Okay. Yeah, you can use the back of the, um, the scoop. Okay. Mm -hmm. use well, the I'm back. really clumsy, so I'm gonna make a mess, guys. So bear with me. Okay, mm -hmm. pour it in. Uh huh. You know the brown scoop that we use for the flour. Uh huh. Um, you can take the back handle of it and use it to stir, like a spatula. Okay. That's good. Yeah. So you say uh -huh. half, teacher. Yeah. So a little I'm bit more. Halfway. A little bit more. Uh huh. Okay. So teacher, can um, a student do this by themselves, or would you recommend? Uh, no, nope. we are safe. We have parents and older siblings um, heat up the water and mix the water. Okay. That's all right, I think I'm about halfway full. Mm -hmm. What do you think? Uh-huh, and then you can mix it. Not with your hand, right? Mm, no, oh, that's I not can. too safe. You can try. Okay. Okay, yeah, use the back. Yeah, there you go, mix it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, this is my first time making play -Doh. I'm excited. Is it clumping up now? Or? Yeah, it is. Okay, and then uh, I think you can go ahead and kind of use your hands to mix it. Okay, that sounds great. And then you can tell me how it feels. Ooh, uh, if it's sticky, sense. if it's sticky or. Oh, this feels nice, guys. Nice and warm and gooey. Okay, do you think we need more water? Cause I kind of add the water as it goes. Um, I think so. Okay, yeah. oh, add I about think, another. I, think I need, I yeah. might need help in pouring water. My awesome teacher is gonna help me pour some. Well, hello there. Hi. Hi, teacher. So, thank you for your help. So, I need help finding a little bit more water. A little bit. Yeah. Thank you for being a super friend and helping teacher Shorty. Maybe a little more, you think? Yeah. Like half of that. All right. Yeah. Okay. Now okay. mix it. Thank you. Oh, You're such thank awesome you for the player. guest appearance. Oh yeah, that's really hot. It's, okay. Well, okay. Like. Uh, so yeah, don't use use don't. the back handle of the uh, the scoop. I think mm -hmm. it'll be okay, but for kids, 
Yeah. Make sure you let your uh, adults help you. Is it spread. watery or is it's watery? It's watery. It's nice. Okay, you can um, mold it and then add a little bit more of the baking flour. Okay. Mm -hmm. This smells good. Mm -hmm. Is there a, um? Do they have like edible Play-Dohs? The Kool-Aid one is edible, but it won't taste good. Well, it's really sticky now. Like, okay. Um, mold it and knead it, and then you can add like maybe like another half cup, which is one scoop of the baking flour, and it should work. Okay. Uh -huh. Oh, see, first time making Play-Doh in. Uh -huh. No. Yeah, you can use a scoop, and just scoop um half. <gasps> yeah. Okay. First time for everything, folks. This looks yeah. like pretty cool. Yeah, if you put another you scoop You say half that, or a whole? The whole, the whole scoop, which is half a cup. Mm -hmm. Half a cup? Mm-hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right, and now you mix it, it should be fine. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love that feeling. It feels so nice and soft, like baby powder. You want to zoom in, Chichu, to see how it looks? Not on me, but <laughs> okay. Oh, that does look pretty cool. And then once it sticks, if you take it out of the bowl and put it on the table, mm -hmm. and then you can knead the dough. So how do you know when it's like? When it feels like dry. Um, put it on the table. Yeah. Blah. There you go. Okay, now clump it all together. You have to like knead the dough and work it, work it in together. Okay, sorry yeah. I'm making a mess, but it's better that way, right? Yeah, see, it's it it is um it's coming to a good consistency. Okay. You just need to like mold it some more, okay. or, and knead the dough. Mm -hmm, it's good. So Make sure you get the, the dough in between your fingers and then, yeah, you're good. Yeah, like if you mold it all together. If it's still a little sticky, you can uh, sprinkle it with um, baking flour okay. to get it off your hands. Okay, gotcha. But it is a good consistency. I can usually Skin tell, there. I can usually tell if from the looks of it. You know this it. what it looks like? Oh, what does it look like? You know how when you have like wet toilet paper, like colored toilet paper or just paper? And gets really wet. It mm -hmm. looks like it from here. I think it's a little bit more blue, but if you add some more red food color, it will turn it purple. Okay. But it might stain your hand, so. Okay. Yeah. I think it's good already. Get in there? Mm hmm. Any last messages? Um, last message? Did you just look? Yeah. Well, guys, thank you for your time and um, being here with me and learning how to play, make Play-Doh. Thank you.